Hey all, Hiba here. So uh, today I'm showing you how to get the legendary hero Tanaka for free in uh, Season 2 of Sea of Conquest. So don't forget to subscribe, right? So uh, it's actually quite easy. Uh, if you go into uh, the Season 2 screen here, uh, available obviously if you're in Season 2, uh, you will notice that we have two new heroes in the season. There's uh, Adeline and Tanaka. And uh, Tanaka is available uh, for free uh, once you start Season 2. And all you really got to do is click the Saga uh, area in the Season area here and uh, you'll do a series of very small tasks here. And uh, down about two thirds down you will get Tanaka, uh, the hero. And if that's not enough, there's also a rare version of the Drifting Wanderer uh, available down at the, almost the end of the um, Saga here. So if you're looking for that trinket, uh, it's available here. Now it's a rare version, not the legendary version, right? But that's still pretty good because it's free. So uh, to get Tanaka, really all you gotta do is just play through this list of missions and they're not difficult at all. It's just, uh, yeah, just tiny little things that needs to be done and really not anything too difficult. Uh, just once in a while you have to do a little bit of combat and then you have to sink a freighter here and there and you know sail from port to another port and stuff like that. It's like simple stuff, there's nothing too demanding here. So uh, even uh, you know, the most low level players should be able to do this fairly easily. So uh, this is the last mission here I'm doing right now before I can get uh, Tanaka. I just have to uh, you know complete that. And uh, that should pretty much do it. So uh, he's available now. So all you got to do is then just click uh, the little, uh, you know, the name of the mission again, the Hex of the Cursed Sword, and it will finish this mission off with a little bit of a cutscene here. And then you can uh, grab the hero just by clicking the icon that's, you know, shiny, glinting a little bit. And uh, that's it. You will now have uh, Tanaka. Now I noticed that because I already have Tanaka, he's converted into 50 uh, hero upgrade points, which I will use in a minute to actually upgrade my Tanaka instead. But of course, if you don't have Tanaka, then this is it. You're getting a pretty good legendary hero for pretty much, well, actually for free. And uh, like I said, if you keep going for another few minutes, uh, you can also get a very nice drifting wanderer trinket to go with him. So uh, like I said earlier, because I already have Tanaka, I can use uh, the 50 promotion points granted to me to actually promote him up to the next rank. So obviously I'm going to do that. That was the whole point of getting him for me. But uh, like I said, if you don't have Tanaka, this is the easiest and the cheapest, it's free way to get him. So I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and uh, let me know what you think in the comments. So uh, see you out there.